Hey everyone. Today, I'm diving into Somebody Somewhere, which just kicked off its third season on Max, and trust me, this season is about to hit differently. Let's talk about why this show is so special, especially if you're into that mix of heart and humor that just feels so real. If you're a fan of series that really get into what it means to find your place in the world, then this is a must-watch. Somebody Somewhere might look like your classic small-town drama on the surface, but let me tell you, there's so much more to it. At its heart, this is the story of Sam, a character you just can't help but root for. Played brilliantly by the talented Bridget Everett, Sam is a true Kansan. But behind that Midwestern exterior, she's struggling big time with fitting into the expectations of her hometown. She's grieving, she's searching, and, like a lot of us, she's trying to find where she truly belongs. Sam's journey is about finding her own voice, which, in her case, means literally finding her voice through singing. And let's be real, when was the last time you saw a show tackle heavy stuff like loss, loneliness, and self-acceptance in such a unique way? One of the things that really stands out to me is how somebody somewhere takes the concept of home and flips it. Instead of presenting a picturesque small town where everyone's living in harmony, it shows the messiness, the hard parts, and all the little awkward moments that come with finding your people. Sam, and the quirky group she bonds with, are a bunch of outsiders in a world that feels like it's constantly trying to make them fit a certain mold. But what's beautiful here is how they come together to form this unconventional, tight-knit community that accepts everyone just as they are. It's a reminder that sometimes, it's the most unexpected connections that can lift us up. And, can we talk about the music in this show? Singing becomes Sam's outlet, her way of healing, and of expressing all the things she's been holding back. It's not just about hitting the right notes, it's raw, it's real, and it's imperfect. You feel every ounce of emotion in her voice, and it adds such a layer of authenticity to her character. She's not singing for applause, she's singing to survive, to cope, and to finally embrace the parts of herself she's been hiding. It's refreshing to see a show use music as a means of storytelling in such an honest way. Season 3 is really diving into some powerful themes of growth and resilience. We're seeing Sam deal with past losses and grapple with some big questions about her future. There's this feeling that even though life can be messy and sometimes painful, there's still this glimmer of hope and change if you just keep pushing forward. The show doesn't sugarcoat things, it's not like Sam's suddenly going to have everything figured out. But we get to watch her grow, stumble, and ultimately find strength in the connections she builds. And the cast. Somebody somewhere has been killing it with its characters. Each one of them brings something unique to the table. They're funny, flawed, and endlessly relatable, which makes the whole show feel like it's not just a story, it's a reflection of real-life challenges and triumphs. Whether you're watching for the laughs, the relatability, or just to see someone embrace their individuality in a world that keeps asking them to conform, this show has got something for you.